Wednesday. Hello and welcome to Never Enough Time to Do This Properly Wednesday. Uh, as usual, it's busy today, but it's a much better busy than it was last week dealing with the bike and stuff. Uh, and this week's been good. I had my coffee today. I uh, had an awesome karmic gift earlier. I, I'll tell you guys about that, actually. Weird little thing. Um, I was uh, out on a break on a class. I went to the vending machine. I just wanted to get I don't know, Oreos or something, and I, I pull out my change, I put it in there, and I'm 15 cents short. I'm like, ah, I'm 15 cents short, that's that's too bad. And, plunk, a quarter falls out of one of the other vending machines. I don't know how that happened, how I manifested that or whatever, but it was awesome. I was like, grinning, like the universe gave me something. That was cool. Uh, just tiny little conveniences are just fun. Um, anyway, theme this week is bands we have discovered recently. Um, I like discovering bands. It's fun. I go to gigs whenever possible because it's fun. It's just what I like to do. Uh, so, I will talk about bands I've discovered lately. Uh, okay, this one doesn't count as discovered lately, but it's one that you should listen to anyway. I've been a fan of Streetlight Manifesto for some years now. They're an awesome uh, ska band. If you haven't heard of them, look them up. Uh, and their lead singer, Thomas Kalnoki, also known as Toe K, uh, has released a solo album, which is essentially him doing Streetlight Manifesto songs acoustic with just him and a guitar, and it's gorgeous. It's called Streetlight Lullabies. Uh, the link will be in the doobly-doo. I'll link you to a song or two, because it's, it's just gorgeous. Uh, so that's one thing that I've been listening to a bunch lately. And the other thing, and this is a new music discovery, as they say, uh, is a band called Dead Sarah. Uh, one of their songs has been getting airplay on the local radio stations occasionally. They're a, a local band from Southern California, Los Angeles, woot woot. Uh, and, um, They've got a song called Weatherman, which has uh, been on the radio lately, and they're awesome. They're a four-piece band, two guys and two girls. The guys are the drummer and the bass player, and both the girls play guitar, and uh, one of them sings. And they're incredible. She's one of the best female guitar players I've seen since Joan Jett. I mean, she, she's great, and the singer has uh, the range of, like, a female Freddie Mercury. It's incredible. Um... If you're looking for songs of theirs to look up, I recommend uh, Weatherman, Lemon Scent, Test on My Patience, and uh, Timed Blues, or Metered Blues, something like that. They're all awesome, though. The entire album is great. I saw them at the Warp Tour kickoff party a couple weeks ago, because uh, Warp Tour is going to be an awesome lineup this year. It's going to be really great. Um, so I went to the kickoff party, and they played... Oh my goodness, do they have an awesome live show. Like, seriously incredible. They went on before The Used, and they're actually opening for The Used this season. The Used just could not compare. And, you know, I generally like The Used live, like they put on a good live show. Not even close. Dead Sarah blew them out of the water. Uh, really incredible. So, I highly recommend them. I will put links to things in the doobly-doo. So, yeah. Later, y'all.